push fit fittings are now very popular. I do know quite a few plumbers who do a lot of installations using push fit. But I also know a lot of people that do not trust them and they always use copy pipe and copy fittings or compression fittings. So we're going to pressure test this on a piece of copy tube and we'll see just exactly how much pressure one of these can actually take. I have done a similar test using a compression fitting and that actually managed to take 50 bar which is 725 psi and that's the maximum amount of pressure that my machine can actually exert on something. I have the bird the pipe already so it is ready for the push fit fitting to be pushed on. We're going to start off by priming the piece of pipe. So I'm just going to pump that until we get water coming out like so and then I'm going to take the push fit fitting and I'm going to push that onto the end ensuring it is all the way on. With this particular one you do need to twist it So that is now pretty tight by hand. It does say on it not to use it with a wrench. I'm now going to hold the fitting next to the dial and then you can see the pressure as it increases. We're now going to pump this up and see what kind of pressure it can take. So we're quickly at 5 bar. And we're now at 10 bar. We are now at 20 bar. Now at 30 bar. Now at 40 bar, and you can see that that is actually exerting a lot of pressure on the actual grip ring. Mm -hmm. I have to say that I'm quite impressed with that. It did take over 40 bar. I'm pretty sure it went nearly 50 bar before the fitting actually failed. You would never get anywhere near that kind of pressure in a domestic plumbing situation. So to be perfectly honest, I was quite impressed with the amount of pressure that could take. People often say they don't trust push fit, but as that proved, they are perfectly adequate for domestic plumbing.